Okay, so this video is in response to people who wonder why they top the ball. Um, it's, you know, a, a problem whether you're a beginner golfer or a, um, you know, more intermediate player. Um, and I get asked the question a lot, why do I top the ball? And the answer is there's not one definitive reason why someone may top the ball. Um, but I'm going to put it out there just to begin with. For sure, the reason you top the ball is not because you lift your head. So I don't care where you are, anywhere in the world, if you're walking up and down any driving range, you'll see people hitting, and if someone tops the ball, then that golfer's friend will say, oh, you lifted your head on that one. Um, with almost certainty, I will say that when you top the ball, it is not because you lift your head. Um, so let's talk about why you do top the ball, okay? So I'm going to go through the three main reasons why people top the ball. Um, the first one is bad posture. Um, so the, the reason in golf that we stand by bending from the hips is so that then as I make my turn, my shoulders are going to turn and my hips are going to turn around my spine. Okay, so having a good posture means that as I turn, you can see that my arms are swinging with some up and down angles. So that's going to give me enough angle to get back down to the ball. If my posture is incorrect and I bend too much from my knees and not enough from my hips, then that means that as I turn around my spine this way, then you can see now my arms are swinging up off the ground. So I'm going to have too flat a swing. So with a club, that means if I'm sitting this way, then I'm going to have a tendency to swing around too much, which is going to top the ball, as opposed to having a good posture that's going to get me swinging on the correct angle. Okay, so number one is, is posture. Uh, number two is swing plane. So we've talked about how the posture can affect the swing plane. So if I'm bending from my knees too much, it gets me swinging around. Uh, well, you could have, you know, a good posture, but the shaft of the club or the arms just get too shallow, and that's going to cause you to top the ball. And similarly, if your swing is too steep, too vertical, then it moves the bottom of the swing forward, which means that you can get a glance and blow as the club swings down to the ball. So the swing can be too shallow or it can be too steep. Either way, it can lead to a top shot, okay? So a good posture is the first step to creating a good plane, and the plane is really important for getting the bottom of your swing in the right place, which is gonna help you with the strike. Okay, so that's two. The third reason that I see and you know, this isn't a definitive list, this is my top three reasons, is that as you swing, you get an early extension, which means that the hips start moving forward, and when the hips move forward, you can see it's had that same effect on my posture as I was talking about with the setup position. Okay, so if during my downswing, then my hips extend forward, then that is gonna shallow out the swing and I'm going to um, swing too high, I'm going to have a tendency to top the ball. So maintaining your posture, making sure that your hips don't extend early, particularly on the downswing, is going to help the club get back down to the ball and hit um, at the right place, ground out at the right place. And it's all, that is all about um, getting a good strike instead of a top. Okay, so my top three um, reasons um, to, to stop your your tops are one, posture, two, swing plane, too steep or too shallow can create a uh, top shot, and three, early extension with your hips. Okay, I hope that helps get rid of some of those tops. Check out some of our other videos. Thanks.